Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In our today's video, we will talk about converting degree to radian and radian to degree. So this one is a quick tutorial for those students na natitake ng STEM, lalo lalo ang subject nyo ay pre-calculus, and under that, meron kayong topic ng unit circle. Importante kasi na matutunan nyo kung paano mag-convert ng degree to radian and radian to degree. Shoutout nga pala kay M. Peña, I hope na mapanood mo itong video natin ngayon. So without further ado, let's do this topic. So in converting degree to radian, uh, let's say for example you want to convert 45 degrees to radian measure. So ano nga ba yung formula in converting a degree measure to radian? Simply, you have the formula degree, your degree angle, times pi over 180 degrees. So, ang gagawin mo lang, following this formula, multiply 45 degrees by pi over 180 degrees. And then, you can directly multiply 45 degrees by pi. But, as you can see, we can simplify 45 degrees and 180 because meron silang greatest common factor, which is 45 degrees. So, we can cancel out 45 degrees. It will become 1. And then for 180, there are four 45 degree angles here. So you have four. And then multiplying the numbers one times pi, it will give you pi. And then four as your denominator. Ibig sabihin, pi over four is equivalent to 45 degrees. Ganyan yung ating conversion. So let's move on with the next example. Our next example will be 120 degrees to radian. So ayusin natin sulat natin. We have 120 degrees to radian. So simplifying or following this pattern, degree times pi over 180 degrees. So 120 degrees times pi over 180 degrees and as you can see you can simplify 120 and 180 meron silang greatest common factor which is 60 so we can have 260 degrees here so 120 and for 180 meron tayong tatlong 60 degrees so multiplying the numbers the remaining numbers 2 times pi you have 2 pi over 3 Ito ngayon yung value ng 120 degree angle in radian. Okay? So, paano ngayon, sir, pag convert naman tayo ng radian to degree? Anong formula natin? So, nagawin nyo na naman, you have the formula radian times 180 degrees over pi. So, as you can see, parang Yung recipe ko lang ito ang ginagamit natin. Isipin nyo lang kung ano yung kailangan nyo tanggalin. Since we need to eliminate the pi, the radian, kailangan natin gamitin yung formula ng radian times 180 degrees pi. So for the first example, let's try converting pi over 6. So ang tanong ngayon, what is the, what is the value or the equivalent value of pi over 6? in degree measure. So following this formula, you have times 180 degrees over pi. As you can see, we can easily eliminate pi. Okay? We can eliminate pi and then simplifying these numbers, you have 180 degrees over 6. Tama? And then simplifying these numbers, this will give you a 30 degree angle. Ito ngayon yung equivalent value ng pi over 6 in degree measure. Pi over 6 is equivalent to 30 degrees. Okay, clear tayo doon. Next example natin, let's try converting 3 pi over 2. Same pattern, if you have this kind of radian, i-multiply nyo lang ito by 180 over pi and by cancellation we can eliminate pi 
and 5. And as you can see, even numbers, yung 2 and 180 degrees. So we can eliminate them. Cancel natin to. Para itong 180 degrees ay magiging 90 degrees. So multiplying the numbers 3 times 90, it will give you 270 degrees. Ito nga yun yung value ng 3 pi over 2 in degree measure. So, I hope na sa first, sa four examples natin, you already know how to convert a degree to radian and radian to degree. If you have any question or topic na gusto nyo pag-aralan natin within our channel, you can comment down below sa ating description box, sa ating comment section. And I hope na natutunan nyo yung lesson natin on how to convert this kind of thing about pre-calculus and if you're new to my channel don't forget to like and subscribe at hit na rin yung bell button for you to be updated sa ating mga latest uploads again i'm teacher gone marami marami salamat bye bye